So today is Monday, guys, and yeah, they're out of school. I'm off, so we came to the park to get some fresh air. We just had a pizza in the truck. What? Your arm? What happened to it? Come here, let me see it. They hurt. Get your face off of it, Kimber. Yeah, Keenan got on his hoochie daddy shorts today. Hoochie daddy shorts. So yeah, I did not come back in the last vlog. I mean, in the last <coughs> y'all, I did not come back in the last clip because I was in utter disbelief of what the doctor had told me was going on with me, y'all. So <coughs> and that and I felt like crap. So I went to the urgent care, y'all, because. Like I said, the last vlog, um, everybody basically had the flu. Started off with Kenzie, then Kimber, then Keenan, then Q, and then Cashton. Um, and so everybody was starting to feel better or whatever. Everybody was better. That's why we did our whole little Father's Day get together or whatever. And then Monday, we did Father's Day Sunday. Monday, I'm sorry, y'all, I'm so stopped up. Monday, I was real tired, like tired, fatigue type. So I knew something was going on. Tuesday, <sighs> my throat was hurting. So in my head, I'm like, damn, I done caught the flu. The flu done caught me. Knew it was too good to be true. Honestly, though, when everybody else was sick, I was a little sick. I wasn't sick like everybody else, but I was a little sick. But anyway, so like, damn, the flu that caught me. So Tuesday, I played it cool for the most part. But like towards the middle of the day, I started getting like really, really, really bad. Like uh, throat on fire. No stop the body hurt and cold I was like Lord so Q had bought me this medicine I took the medicine or whatever I got a little relief so when I woke up this morning I was actually feeling better but my chest was trying to hurt so I was scared y'all I was scared because I was like excuse this big ass bump I was like about my chest hurting you know I don't play about when my chest hurt Cause I don't got time. I got kids to live for. So I dropped the kids off at school. I was like, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the urgent care. So went to the urgent care, y'all. I'm thinking the man gonna come back and be like, Oh, you got the flu. I got COVID. I have COVID again. Why do I keep getting COVID? 
which made complete sense. I mean, yesterday Q was like, can you smell? But y'all, honestly, I had COVID the first time back in November. I've never regained my smell back. Like, I could smell sometimes, depending on what it is. But, no, I... I so I couldn't answer him if I could smell because I'm like, man, you know I can't smell. I could be could smell, so I don't know. <clears throat> I can still taste, but I'm congested as hell. I'm congested as hell. As far as how I feel now, I feel much better outside of being congested. I feel okay. I pray that it stay this way. You know, I still got my appetite, all that good stuff. So, you know, yeah. They told me to stay out for five days, which would be from today, the 29th. But since I had my symptoms, it would be like Monday because I started experiencing it on like Monday or Tuesday. So, yeah. This lit, this lit, that item from the sidebar. What? What are you talking about? So, yeah, I just wanted to come in and check in with y'all. Let y'all know that your girl got COVID again. And, you know, I'm a little sad this time, but I was sadder Tuesday when I started getting sick and this morning because I was just like, damn, why I always got to be the one worried about exposing other people. You know what I'm saying? Why well, I always gotta have that stress on my chest. But, you know, like my mom and them keep telling me, this is the times that we live in there right now. So, you know, you never know. Like, it, it, it would be different if I was feeling sick Sunday. I was not sick Sunday, y'all. I was good. So, you know, it wasn't nothing intentional or nothing so you know uh, right now I'm just trying to get myself well I'm taking my vitamins I being cashed in we can go all day without drinking we will have to put no liquids in our body and that's really bad so that's one thing I'm trying to work on right now is staying hydrated because I don't have to drink it would be 10 o'clock at night and I'd be like damn I ain't even had any drink today you know so yeah, guys. Yeah, your girl has COVID. So I'm sitting here in the room by myself waiting on Q to come home. He has to get my truck so that he can go pick the babies and cash them up. I had to go pick Kingston up because his camp closed at 4. And Q, as you can see, still hasn't got here. It's 4.59. So I had to go get Kingston. So I just put on... A whole lot of masks. He said all the way back in the back of the truck, six feet away for sure. And yeah, he's been up in his room since we got home. So try not to spread it, y'all. I'm trying not to spread it. I pray to God ain't nobody else got it. Because, you know, trying to isolate is so hard. Isolation is so hard. You know, it's only five days now, but hell, who knows? My fifth day, honestly, would be Friday. I don't know how we feel on Friday, because right now, baby, I'm just, y'all, yes, yesterday, I ain't had what to tell my mom. I had told my sister, I ain't what to tell my mom. But I was like, oh my God, I don't know about this. I was so freaking sick, yeah. But anyway. I ain't gonna talk y'all here around. Y'all just continue to uplift us in prayers. I don't know why we keep having all these germs in this house. Bye, y'all. So, this time around, I got my appetite. And Q cooked dinner, y'all. He's so funny because he came in here talking about he did his thing. Y'all, why this man don't never cook? He don't never cook. But you gonna get in there and cook like that. I'm let y'all know for the see how it tastes. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Y'all. So I had washed my head the other day. I think I had told y'all 
when I was doing my hair, I just noticed how much heat damage I had. So I decided, I decided not to put heat on my hair for the remainder of June or July, possibly August too. We'll see. I don't know, but I'm I'm trying to stay away from heat because you know y'all know I would go into the Dominicans regularly at one point, and I think that really damaged my hair. So I had washed it the other day, and when I got out, I just put some two strand twists to the back, about five of them to the back. I put some rubber bands on the end. I kept it like that. Because as y'all know, I'm in quarantine with the COVID. So I wasn't going away anyway. So I just did it like that. For it to air dry. Ow. And I've never tried that before. But they did pretty good. My roots is thick as a motherfucker. Though. But today, I got me some hair. Today is my fifth day, so I ventured out of the house. Y'all know that I have changed these stupid-ass rules to five days. Even though today, I still ain't feeling too good. But, hey, whatever. I went to the beauty supply store. I wore my mask and gloves. <clears throat> and got me some... Hair, and I'm about to try to do some soft locks, y'all. Since I'm going to sit in my room probably the rest of the weekend. Woo. Woo. So since this is my first time doing this, I'm going to start from the front of my head. But I just want to check in with y'all right quick. Yeah, I'm starting start from the front. Fuck I'll be back. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my hair again. I don't know how to not do small parts. I do not like big parts. But I do not want a whole lot of these things in my head. So I'm thinking I still got to do the back. I'm thinking they're going to be big back there. The part's going to be big back there. They're going to be big. But this is why I met with it, y'all. This is why I met with it. It's the next morning. I had stopped last night. I only did this side last night. And I braided down this side. And I just put the rest of the little lock things in there. So now I'm going to tackle the back side. See how long this takes. Yeah, it's been too many days. I don't even know how many days it's been, y'all. But your girl officially, I don't even know if I came back and told y'all, but I don't have. Well, when I tested, I didn't have COVID anymore. Oh, yeah. I've been feeling better for a few days now. Yesterday and today, I've been feeling a little. Yeah. I might have started moving too fast or whatever, but <clears throat> other than that, I've been okay. Still taking my vitamins, still vitamin up. So, yeah. I came out this morning because I actually needed to run a few errands, get a few things to the house, and I knew that if I went home after dropping the kids off, it was not going to get done because it didn't get done yesterday so i was like let me get out and about this morning so i can knock it all out the way excuse me oh so, yeah i'm about to go in ross i need to find a couple of personal items i like to shop in ross for things like that because i just like to shop in ross for things like that and then i'm gonna go in target to get whatever i did not get but yeah I'm tired, y'all. I think after this, the boys, the big boys went on, are going on a field trip today with summer camp. And they asked me to come with them, but I'm tired. So I think I'm going to go home, do some work, and lay down. I don't know, but anyway, I just went to check in with y'all because it's been days. I don't think I've checked in since, like, Saturday when I was doing my hair. Yeah, and today is Tuesday. So, yeah, guys.
I am home. I am so sorry. I'm put my purse up here. I'm already broke. You don't put your flow purse on the flow. I'm back home. I did a horrible job at vlogging while I was out. Mainly because I wasn't supposed to be out spending money like that, but I did it anyway because, yeah, I just tend to do that all the time. So, as y'all know, it is July. It is the month of birthdays in our household. Cash's birthday is July 7th. My dad's birthday is July 6th. Kingston's birthday is July 26th. And then five days later, I think... Six, seven days later, it's the triplets on August 4th. So, <clears throat> we are starting off Cassius' birthday. So, Cassius, today I went to get his gifts so I can knock his out and then just have to worry about my daddy's gifts and Kingston's birthday party. Uh, Cassius is turning to be five. So, his first gift for me is a new comforter because Cassius does not have a comforter on his bed and has not had one on his bed for like... A month now because Keenan decided to poop on his comforter. So, not really a gift, but we're gonna start his birthday off with it. Then I got Tim. I said that we were not getting all those toys this year, and I meant that because they don't play with them toys, they don't know what them toys be at, and we was not doing it. So, for his birthday, we are going to a water park. So, I got him some cute little swim trunks. I'm gonna get him a cute little tank top and swim shoes to go with this. Might get him a little shirt that says it's my birthday or something. I don't know. Then, as y'all know, my big baby is going to kindergarten and he is so excited about being able to carry a book bag and taking his lunch because he could not do that in pre-K. And he is so excited about that. So this is a gift for him as well. It's a five piece. It comes with the book bag, the little drawstring book bag, lunch box, and... I think that's a pencil pouch. I don't know. Some kind of pouch. Some type of little pouch right there. So, yeah, he's going to love that. He is going to love that. I love this for him. I wanted to get Paw Patrol, but Mom said, don't be too babyish. He's going to kindergarten, so I didn't get babyish. And then, y'all, I got other stuff in here that I ain't going to be doing. I got Keenan some little Crocs. Ain't he so cute? Because Keenan does not have any Crocs. Everybody else in the house has Crocs but Keenan. And he always be trying to put on the girls' little glittery Crocs. And Q be like, take them Crocs off. So I got him these little Crocs from TJ Maxx. They're so freaking cute. I also got him some swim shoes because they ain't had nothing for nobody else. But I got them for him because they were only $7. And like I said, we're going to see what apart. Got the girls some little Nike socks because I am trying to start playing tennis shoes on them a little more. I purchased this. This is why I said I like going to TJ Maxx and Ross. Let me sit down because it's quite and it's not it. I like to get little items like this. So I found this. This is the shan I use this brand shampoo and conditioner on on baby's hair. Well, all of their hair. But I just know that this is a good brand, period. So I was like, let me try their little stretch mark cream, okay? Whatever, because I do got some little stretch marks that I do not like. I also got this body butter. One thing I am trying to work more on is hydrating my skin, because, baby, I be ashy and the skin be rough. And I don't like that. And I know my husband don't like that. He ain't never said nothing, but I know he don't like it. Also, wanted to try out this little lip mask, lip balm, whatever. It was on clearance, clearly, because somebody raggedy is toward the box. Hydrating overnight lip treatment. Mm -hmm. What else I got? Oh, I got cash in this little cup. Yeah, he loved Brian, so I just thought this was cute. So I just got it just, just to get it. I hate these keys, y'all. What else I got? So I have a Nike swimsuit. I just got me this little Nike score skirt. It's like a little swimsuit skirt. To the water park because yeah don't y'all hate the um when the parents be coming out there the girls be coming out there to the water parks with the thong bikinis on and stuff like sis this is a family place there's children here why is your whole ass out i hate that so i got me the little shirt i got me a little shirt too i just thought this was cute this free your mind free your mind 
I, I get the concept of why I'm saying free your mind. I don't free my mind in that type of way, but I still thought the shirt was cute. I love a good, I love a good foot jam. No, I love a good uh, tea. A little tea. But y'all, this is Cash's main gift. Besides the water park and all that, this is his gift from me and daddy. Um, he does not seem to be into stuff like this, but we're going to see. He might be into it once he gets it. You know what I'm saying? We're going to try it out for him now. <sighs> so, yeah, I'm excited for him to get this. I hope he's excited. Yeah. I was going to wait to get it, but I just went ahead and get it. And then got it because, you know, you never know. You see it today, and then you go back tomorrow, and they all bought out. Then I went to Walmart. I got a few toiletries, soap, toothpaste, deodorant the stuff that we need in the house, and some stuff to make nachos and tacos. Excuse that mess over there, y'all. But yeah, I love y'all. I just wanted to check back in because, yeah, your girl did not come back like she was supposed to and vlog, and mainly that was because, like I had said earlier, hold on, let me turn the camera around. Like I had said earlier, I was try starting to feel a little weak, so I was just trying to get done what I need to get done so I can get back to the house, do my work, and so on and so on so yeah guys i love y'all i love y'all i love y'all i'm about to do my work and chill i might come back tonight when i make these tacos maybe i don't know